Hello everybody, welcome back to Field Advanced Camera Edition. We rolled the flagship because we beat it on the last run. And I think I'm going to go with the... yeah. This one. Let's look at our data to see what our flagship is all about. Uh, flagship room, extremely spacious, all of the huge room in the connector, space for repair and security. So that's the same thing as last time. Mind control cloaking is also the same time. Main guns, heavy dual, and a burst laser. Burst ion, burst ion. Lots and lots of ions, then, huh? Complex drone, combat drone, swarm missile, repair drone, enhanced shield recharger, and a reverse engineered medical nanobots. Okay. That'll do for now. Okay. Uh, I think I'm just going to keep talking to the human because slugs, whatever it is they offer, it costs me money. <clears throat> now, it's going to be a bit of an annoying one, I would say, to take care of the enemy here. Two rockmen, they tend to have quite a big amount of health. That's a great start. Come on. Alright, that shield's back up at least. This is gonna be a <clears throat> kind of a tough one, I would say. Killed one. Problem is, if you want to kill the other one as well, uh, breaches could help. Could well mess with their oxygen supply at least. Let's see what we can do here. Took a lot of damage on that first fight. That's never a good sign to start your runoff with, but. Okay, heavy eye on. Not the worst weapon. I'll put it up instead of the Lido in case we ever come into. Ah, it takes two ammo. Uh, weapon power, huh? Uh, it's a bit annoying, but we'll probably manage. Sure. Okay, now nothing happened there. We had a clone base, so we probably would have been safe. Okay, free stuff, which means get that. No, we can't get that other weapon online. It shields up then. Sure, we got two shields, space rations. Let's get those two shields up if we still can. They really want me to die here, don't they? What did I ever do to you? Okay, well at least we are probably good to go here. Ah, man. I know the asteroids come a lot quicker when there's no enemy ship, but still. Sure. <clears throat> Alright. Another ship with a lot of shots. Okay. Let's see what we can do here. One crew member dead. Hmm. 
The black cannon is being a bit uh, bad. <clears throat> okay. That's that crew member dead. So we accept and we open fire. And then we can kill the crew to get maximum profit. Cool. And that's the way it goes. All right. Uh, yeah, sure. Could try to get some for free, but I'd rather just buy it. Okay, NGs are annoying, <clears throat> but we shouldn't be that much of in a bad spot. Did that make sense to you? Icon weapon is annoying, but as long as our shields don't get hit, we should be more than fine. <clears throat> okay, let's wait up on these, see if they are willing to surrender at some point. Doesn't look like it. So we'll kill him. Probably a firebomb then. Still here a fire, but I don't know where. Five hole points. Fire must be here somewhere then. <clears throat> Alright, well, let's get one more of these so we can keep our shields up at all times. Let's see if the fire is indeed somewhere over there. Yep, there it is. Okay, um, don't really need that store, I think. Right, three shots on these guys and some sort of drone. Like that, like that. Um, I can't take slaves. But I can drop off at the next station. Ah, that surrender is not an option. <clears throat> I think at this point scrap is a bit more important to me. Come on! Why is it that impossible for me to hit the other weapons? And I know that if I shoot that weapons now, it's gonna kill. Ah, well, such is life, right? Where are you going now? Um, find a number of slaves in the cargo. They look at you, question you, and ask for one 
least you could use more crew, but you don't really want to force them to work for you. Some, fortunately, some of them off ah, they offer. We'll let the mantis join. <clears throat> we'll put him on shields. Okay, what do they have? That's not a concern. See, good thing I took the mantis with me. So their weapons are non-issue. Though they can pierce. He can get rid of my shield, which he does need to do if he wants to take care of my... A lot of breaches that I do not have to worry about. Because <coughs> we got Slug Gel. Alright, so when's the final dude? Okay, now we can see if they are willing to surrender. Which means do some damage to him, or at least try to. Oh, there's two people left. Where did you come from, number three? Probably gonna kill him now. No. Well, I have to keep shooting it to see if it surrenders. Doesn't look like it. Okay, all I gotta do is kill him before he gets that. Man. There we go. And we got another mantis. Which is great for boarding. We'll put you on doors for now. Alright, no need to go to that store. Let's just move on. Should get those shields back up actually. Cluster breach bomb. Breach bomb's good. Breach bomb's good. I've got a lot of missiles, so. Requires two power and this is guaranteed to cause a breach, right? No, medium. Hmm. <coughs> It's 35, but we need two of them if you want to keep everything online. Ugh. Zone of understanding. Well, if I had long range scanners, I would go to the Nebula to avoid the empty beacons, but uh, ah, have a look at secret data. So I already do that. So to do that to yeah, we, we looked at this before. Ooh, more music? No, it looks like a normal one, just to start. Uh, let's try to get some for free. I need to get rid of this as well. So I don't know if these are willing to surrender, and even if they do, can I still get the option to kill them? I don't think I do, so let's just shoot them to death. Um, station... There's no formula they want to surrender, they offer some fuel if you let them go, yeah. 
I think I can get more if I kill them. Nope. But I traded one fuel for 25 scrap, so that's probably even better. Anyway, moving on. Zoltan ship. Uh, don't have a teleporter. Great, so now I can't even do anything about it. I don't think he's going to destroy all the doors. Shot him dead. Oh. All of their crew is dead. But I can't seem to be hitting that clone bay. There we go. Now stop shooting at that and go after that. <clears throat> See if they're willing to surrender. And then we can decide on... Uh, Problem. There's a problem, there's a problem, there's a problem. Problem is that if they don't surrender in time, I will not be able to get that clone bay down anymore. Alright, so we'll shoot at the clone bay now, and if they aren't surrendering by then. Accept, open fire. There we go, now we can kill him. Now the thing is... Yeah, okay. <coughs> it could have gone differently, but it didn't, so we're good. What's with all the clone bays? Okay, he's not coming back because that clone bay was ionized. Was. Now it's back. Lucky me, huh? and open fire. And all we have to do is hope that not all three of those hit. Good. He can't have too much more health left, can he? Well, that breach is going to make sure he's not repairing any of those things. Good fight. Let's head to the store before we decide on uh, buying or selling anything. Definitely getting rid of the Lido though. Hacking sector scanner, anti ship battery. Anti ship battery is pretty fun. And I don't nearly use enough missiles, so let's get that a, give that a go. Let's upgrade. Alright, so now we got a bridge bomb. <clears throat> let's hope it does something good for us. Well, it can certainly miss. 
Well, that wasn't the bridge bomb, but you know what I mean. Alright. That takes care of that problem. Now we just sit and wait. Because there's not much more to do. He still got engine power? Alright, good, 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 good. So that's a dead end. Socialize with the human. Man, humans, what's wrong with you, man? The other dudes are talking about philosophy and stuff like that. Ooh, my life's broken. <sighs> Can't I use bombs on that? Or does it have to be a firebomb? Hmm. Guess we'll find out. PDS. So getting the F out of here isn't something my ship is uh, exceptionally good at. but we did do three system damage which is something really good actually keep hitting that ng last remaining match defender realizes that continued fighting is pointless but decides that jettisoning itself into open space is still better than being defeated and exits the ship through an airlock bye Great, well there goes a layer of shields. And if I'm not mistaken, these things fly straight through. So depending on how this goes, we can either decide to... What if one of these shots hit? Okay, let's see if we can get him to surrender first. Which means not hitting the room he's in. Okay, we can try one more shot, so then we'll have to see what happens. Not surrendering. Hull Smasher Laser Mark III and Life Support Gear. Good haul. Three power, though, for three shots. Oh well. Considering our advanced flag only needs one, but that's a weapon you can't find. Uh, attack. Just <clears throat> trying to escape. That'll do, do nicely. He's out. Oop, stop. Except... I uh, won't be able to attack them again. Why, 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 why? Home volume. What's 
wrong. Zexor lost someone who's very dear. See, you want to track down. Let's go. Ah, uh, yes. No, thank you. Two missile launchers and three shields. You see that shit? Um, I'll secure it. Season AP, John. Does it just do more damage? I think that's what it does. Sure, we'll sell that off. Now. Yeah, I think it just does more damage. It isn't, which isn't bad, but... Is there another store here? No, not really yet. Um, hacking would go really well here. Getting that whole smasher up would be pretty sweet as well. Probably would re use it to get uh, replace it. <laughs> would probably have it replace this light laser. Auto light auto. Nine, thirteen for. Th yeah, I suppose I might as well sell this one, right? Because it can shoot more. Or I could get rid of the breach cluster. Cluster bomb is pretty good, so yeah. I said I was gonna try out some bombs, so let's just do that. <coughs> now Oh man. I think we're already done with our weapon systems then. Is would this be enough to take care of the flagship? I'll probably remove the auto laser. I wonder. I'm looking at the name here. At I, I don't know. Could be cool if that's a reference to me, but <coughs> let's just say I would like to believe that it is. And if it isn't, then don't tell me. Now, what are we doing here? Um, fuel could be good. I think we're actually just fine. Mapping computer... That could help. Nah. Doesn't matter that much. Uh, quest was a... Wasn't a... Was not a... Cruiser, was it? Uh, the pursuit location. Ah, slavery. Okay. Get us a tour board. Blah, let's get us in. Wow, that's a hefty beam we probably want to destroy. And thankfully for us, it's probably pretty possible to do that. Alright, that's a lot of breaches as well, which I can't feel anything but good for. Um, Clone Bay will have to go down as well at some point. Figure that out. I think that was that mall beam, wasn't it? Okay, that's one of them dead, which means now is our time to take care of that Colombe. Just keep shooting that auto laser in. Okay, he's dead, which means now it's once again time for this. Why are you bothered that much by getting that clone bay up? Or did you just ignore clone bay once it went completely into the red? Probably should have looked if I could uh, let them surrender, but uh, eh. it was something my crew wanted me to do, so. Uh, you are relieved of your duty. 
and you can just be on patrol for borders. My bad, but we might as well wait until all lasers are ready to double misses. Ah, I hit him. Miss, miss. Two hits. Get out of there. Cool. Should save the layout here, huh? Get you there, you there, and we'll save. Didn't bring any weapon on the line, but it did kill the final crew member. And once again, I forgot to see if they would surrender. Uh, I have no need for a drone schematic. I have no need for nano repair, so I will give them nothing. Unfortunately enough. <clears throat> so cloaking here would be ideal, but I don't think I have the scrap for that. And it didn't... Uh, backup DNA bank is apparently something that's pretty darn good, but... Um, I think I could do without. Hey to the civilian sheep. So in theory, we are just completely fine here. Well, at least I'm leveling up the gunner a little bit. So now we just hurt them and see if they uh, will surrender. Quickest way to do that. Cabin appears we are leaking atmosphere, blah 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 blah. Alright, so it does look like we'll be dealing with a surrender here. So we'll just continue doing what we're doing, killing crew. Which could really take a while. I know that. <coughs> but we're leveling up people while we're doing it, so... It's gonna take a long time. I should be able to do one more damage to him if I fire in two hull laser shots. And before the third one, I can fire depower the weapon. Let's try that. There's one. Eep. Yeah. Ah, I fired it at the one. In I fired it at the one room I couldn't fire it at. Luckily. That final shot from the light laser did it. Sure, welcome aboard. It's a ghost. It's gonna be useful to... Hmm. Actually, you're not gonna be useful. Unless we get blue options, but I was gonna say useful to cover up breaches, but we have slug repair gel, so... Breaches be damned! You arrive near a small fleet of civilian NG ships, a simple decryption into la 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 message them. I do not have an NG on board. That would have been the Stealth Cruiser Unlock quest. Oh, being shot from every single 
direction, but at least we got clean air. I'm gonna wait, see if I can get cloaking somewhere. Hmm. Cool. That's a full crew. Got three Manti. Which may make me consider boarding, but I know it's the freaking huge flagship play out again, so... <clears throat> hmm. We're still fairly early on, aren't we? Ah, take the weapon. Adaptive focus beam. How much power do you need? Two. You know... I could put that up there. Focus beam can go up to three damage, can it not? Yeah. Uh, this might not be the smartest idea I ever had, okay? Do you can only pierce two shields, so we'll even have to start making preparations for that to be a thing. Um, we're gonna go for weapons first, right? Keep the pressure on now. It's weird to sh see a station with cloaking. And it doesn't really make sense. I mean, I'm assuming they're going from the fact that uh, you can't see a ship that's cloaked. I don't think this thing is going anywhere anytime fast, so... Still, it's an interesting thing. Um, we're gonna wait on doing more damage, although I don't think they will be surrendering. Another one's dead. And if I don't do more damage to the enemy crew, I don't get that nasty message that all of my wingmen are dying. No more license are detected on the pirate station. You proceed to salvage equipment. It was spawn the but get no response. After some searching, you discover one of the civilian ships drifting within the field with no license detected. This post battle and answer suggests that the whole defense force was wiped out. Yeah. Okay. That probably could have gone better. Discovered the stress signal grenade from the center of a nearby system. So we invested past too close by the local sun. Their engines and shields were damaged by a solar flare, and they're now in danger of drifting into the star. Use your mechanical arm to tow them to safety. You managed to pull the ship back to safety before the next flare hits. Can't believe they're luck enough for supplies and tanks for the rescue. And any directions towards a store would be well appreciated as well. A devil like is floating near this beacon that contains something valuable. Fireball Mark Three is that better than uh, slightly slower than normal fireball launch? Does more damage to crew and also does initial damage to systems. Forty-five crew damage, one system damage, and a high chance of fire. What do I prefer, fire or breaches? If 
Pyres are more damaging to crew overall, I would say. Once again, it doesn't look like we are in any form of immediate danger. Unless that thing does two ion damage on every pass, it does. But I don't think it does. Or at least severely surprised me. Okay. And then we get to doing this for three years. Well then, I think that it's time to kick back. <sighs> and ponder life or something. I don't know. Um, yeah, I'm just waiting for crew to die here. I think, think the dude in shields is a... Rockman does with a bit of luck it's a uh, AI avatar and then it'll be dead pretty quickly, but uh, once one of them's dead I'll probably start shooting just to see if they are willing to surrender. Why well, I have enough with one reward when you might be able to get away with two. Stop doing that and start doing more of this. Accept their offer and open fire. And then we kill them. Yes, it's cheesy, but sometimes you gotta do everything you can to survive. And we're not doing too bad for ourselves, but still, it's good to be a complete. <clears throat> Sometimes. Probably gonna get rid of one of the humans. Uh, I'm getting someone that's good on weapons, so you can replace him. And I'll be one ninja as well on board. Who will be in charge of doors? Lots of scrap. But I really, 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 really want. Uh, heal them. Continue. Why not throw a firebomb in there for a change, huh? Could be cool. That's the mine launcher gone. One slug is already dead. Freaking mine launcher made it back in. And we killed them all. Not what I wanted to do, but... There's a store. Let's see. Systems. Come on, systems. No systems. Fuel recycler isn't bad, but uh, I don't think I have. Yeah, I don't have any room left. Um, for some reason, I still think this is better. I wonder why. I mean, breaches or fires, it seems like... Fire or breach, fire or breach. I'm more of a fan of fire. Alright, we got a whole bunch of scrap. Still gonna keep the firebomb, don't worry. I guess we just upgrade some stuff. Yeah, no more stores. Alright, shields. Engines. And we still got a bunch of scrap left. It's 
still got a lot of scrap left to invest. Fire the missiles or the scrap. Uh, we've got some. We got a mats in reserve if we need it, which we didn't. Everyone back to their stations. Does that make sense now? Not yet, and now it does. I think we'll be getting a surrender offer. Ah! Accept! Open fire! Now we're stuck with using nothing but the auto laser, which is fine because there's a fire on board their ship. And Manta can't really deal with that very well. Just have to make sure it doesn't destroy a system. And the only thing it could destroy is shields, and I think we're almost done here anyway. Because he decided not to pursue... Ooh, Zoltan as well. Um, how many Manta do I have? Two. No, I got three. Get some more species on board this thing. Um, question is, where do I put you? I suppose I'll put you on weapons, which means you can free roam as well. It's a waste to let that power go unused, so. Yeah, sure. Yeah. Oh yeah, you can just go from room to room. That's stupid. When you might control an enemy, you can walk through your doors. You get one of your crew, my control can walk through doors. Can't really say I get that, but uh... Wow. 45% evasion and they all hit. That's bad luck right there, right? That's not coming back online. Alright, so the beam should do two damage on this next shot. Probably gonna be the last one as well. Let's see. Yep, that was a two in there. Nice. Ooh, lots of stuff. Um, cool. Moving on. Crew is uh, getting back to. Ooh, that looks cool. Uh, let's get some for free, cause I'm a douche on this run. And there is crew to be killed. And it does look like we are in any immediate threat here, so this is going to be a pretty easy one then. <laughs> Allows for my gunner to level up a bit. How many shots does he have to fire, actually? 65. <laughs> That's going to take a while. Huh. Oh, he's gonna try and repair that. Okay, I thought he was just gonna go man them, which would have been strange, because I thought they would... Nope, he is manning shields. <laughs> Not the uh, sharpest knife in the drawer, is he? Does he just not get that uh, I'm not even touching his shields? Pretty fun that they use this... Uh, particular enemy as a repair station actually. Alright, five hull points and a bunch of stuff. Gotta love that slug gel. Uh, 
Uh, prove your reactor. No thanks. Ooh, store. E yes. I know I'm bumping into the rebel fleet, but uh, if I get cloaking here, that's going to be a moot. Mute. Hmm. Missile, missile, missile. Shield charge booster, life form scanner, battery charger. If I knew this crap would have been in here, I probably wouldn't have gone here. Um. How many places do I still have? Three. <sighs> teleporter could be good, but what would I still have to get? Let's say teleporter, cloaking, hacking? Yeah. That could actually work. Which means I could get rid of the light auto thing as well. Sure. And I'll get rid of the light auto and we'll put the firebomb back there. We'll get... Do we need more power? Yes. We actually need two more for some strange reason. Ah, no, we just need to upgrade that once. There we go. And now we have a place for you. Still not sure if it was the smartest idea on that whole thing, but we'll see. Our engines are pretty strong that we can get out of here pretty quickly. Uh, we do have ASB, but no PDS, which is Im apparently impossible to get, which is great. Well, let's give this a shot. And the missile mist. Well, brace yourselves. It's a miss. Time to start some fires, because uh, that's probably a meta sector. Yep. Uh, socialize with. Always have to talk to you, Captain. Oh. Now, you are almost dead, which means I'll switch out with you. And you are also almost dead, so I'll switch out with you. <coughs> and now everyone's almost dead. It's been a long while since I bought a teleporter. Anyway, that's gonna be it for this episode. So thank you guys for watching. I hope you're still enjoying the series. If you show support by commenting, liking, and or selling. And I'll see you guys on the next episode. Bye everyone.